Oh my goodness, this is taking forever to load. One eternity later. Oh, it downloaded. Awesome. Okay, let's play Origami King. Man, I'm really excited about this. Ooh, wow, that's beautiful. I feel the rumble in my Joy-Con from the car. That's cool. Isn't this great, bro? Back on the road again together and heading to the same kind of festival. What did the invitation say again? An origami festival? What's that gonna be like? And I can't wait to say hello to Princess Peach. It's been a while. I don't know what kind of accent I'm doing. I don't know. That's just what I picture Luigi sounding like. So origami festival. Look at all the pretty colors, guys. Here we are, Toad Town, and there's Princess Peach's castle. Oh, origami everywhere and it's abandoned. Paper Mario and Luigi. I thought this realm was abandoned. Mario's like, what the heck? What's going on here? Where is everybody? You don't think we missed it, do you? Mario, check the invitation again. When were we supposed to be here? Woohoo! Oh, it says, uh, you are invited to an origami festival in fabulous Toad Town. Date, 00XXPH. Well, it's the right day. You think they're still getting things ready? You look at Bug Fables and then look at this game. This series was what Bug Fables was originally trying to represent, but this is the game that has drifted away from the formula. So it'll be interesting to see the differences between Bug Fables and this game now that you've seen me play both of them, because they're really different games. Let's -a go check the castle. Maybe everyone's inside. Woohoo! Well, let's go, Luigi. Woohoo! Riding on the back of your car. To let's go. Woohoo! Woohoo! I'm Mario. Ooh, look at this. This is pretty abandoned. Wow. There is no toads in sight. And I have a really bad Mario impression. Ooh, woohoo, waha! Oh, Princess Peach's Castle theme! From Mario 64. We are here, Peach's Castle. Oh, just like how I remember it. I really gotta work on my Mario impression since I'm playing a lot of Mario games. I'm gonna park the cart, okay? I don't wanna tip the valet. Ah, greedy Luigi. Don't you have enough money? with everything you earned from your mansion endeavors, your mansion escapades. Sorry for the wait, bro. Let's go see the princess. Don't hit the staff. Yes, remember. Luigi may be a millionaire, but he's the best example of what a real millionaire is like in our society today. It looks pretty. I love it. I love it so far. Like, how pretty it looks. It's kind of spooky in here, isn't it? And where is everybody? I expect to see at least one toad by now. Mamma mia! I forgot our gift in the cart! I'll just dash over and get it! Oh no! It closed! Okay, I don't like that. How am I gonna get outside when the door is locked? Don't worry, Mario. I know just what to do in situations like this. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna take a deep breath and go find the key to this door. That's what you do, right? <laughs> okay, let's get out. Ugh, shake it, shake it harder. Come on, Mario. Let's go. Come on. Ah, uh, whatever. I can check my inventory, but I have nothing here. I have boots. It's all about them boots. Oh, do I have any useful items? So Mario has absolutely no useful items on him whatsoever. He's just one of the most useless people. Mario, is that you? How good to see you. 
That doesn't sound like Princess Peach. No, don't get any closer, Mario. Of course, you had to go right in the middle of the sun carpet. That's convenient. Answer me this. Shouldn't the Mushroom Kingdom unfold and be refolded unto glory? Uh... It sounded a little bit creepy there, Peach. Oh, it should! Yeah, you have a point there. And what of those toads? Shouldn't they be silence for all eternity? I thought you'd never ask! <laughs> You don't know how you feel about Peach's voiceover? That's not the real Peach, that's a fake Peach. She's the origami folded up evil Peach. So she gets a old lady evil voice, okay? I see. Last question. <laughs> Will you crease yourself and be reborn like me? Of course, princess. Ooh, that sounds pretty nice, actually. I want to crease myself, yeah. Wrong answer, right answer. It matters not. Your replies are paper thin. Oh, shoot! The close up! It's like a jump scare from Five Nights at Freddy's right there. Oh! Goodbye! Woo! <laughs> Mario! Oh, who are you guys? Always gotta make a flashy entrance, huh? Are you here for the Origami Festival too? This dungeon-themed waiting lounge is a huge upgrade from the last festival I attended. Very classy. Yeah, it's probably because you're in the Koopa Kingdom. Uh, Bowser's not the classiest person. Ain't seen any Master Bowser anywhere, have ya? It ain't like the big lug to leave us minions hanging at the public event. Whoa, Mario, you're here! I'm a big fan, er, I mean, I've always wanted to battle you, even if I get stomped, it would be an honor. Wow, this is all so exciting. First I see Princess Peach, and uh, now you. I gotta say, the princess was a little different than I expected. Uh, less lifelike? Whoa, what's happening? The origami shy guys! Come with us. Goomba just has a death wish. Like, even from the original Mario games, you could tell that because Goombas and Koopas, they don't care. They're ruled by an evil dictator. They have to serve him. They feel like there's no sense of relief in their life, and they just walk off the level. They don't even care if they get stomped or not. The red shelled Koopas, though, those are the ones that really care. Because they turn around, they don't walk off the edge. Uh -huh. Yeah, what's next? I've never seen a toad before. Please tell me it's a toad. Aw. He's such a fan of the Mushroom Kingdom for being part of the Koopa Kingdom. Not you. Aw. Hope you don't have to wait too long, Mario. I'll say hi to Toad for ya. Oh no! The poor Goomba! He just wants a good experience in the Mushroom Kingdom, and this was his first chance, and now he's gonna get folded into origami against his will. Or worse. Mario, is that you? I need your help. I'm... I'm... I'm in a very strange place. It's cramped and dark, almost like I'm in between dimensions or something. I'm not sure if I should be amazed or scared, but I'm kind of both. If it's not too much trouble, I'd like to get out now, please. Is there any way you can help? No, I'm afraid not. I'm just Mr. Jumpman. Hey, I got a hammer! Wow, it's my hammer! I can smash things now. Whoa. What was that? Did something light up at your feet? Is it a magic circle? That's good. I think, I mean, I'm not really sure what you're supposed to do with it. 
Can you try to use it somehow? Oh, uh, I, you know, I guess there's no harm in trying. Uh, a thousand fold arms? Uh, I, I could have sworn that there was something similar to that a few games ago, but I can't quite put my finger on it. I feel like this game's vastly different. It's lost a lot of its appeal as that game. Huh. Oh well, it's probably nothing. Whoa, I have lanky arms. That that sounded good. Are your arms all big and foldy now? Uh, they certainly are. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. Mario reveals for the next arms DLC. Making his way to the ring. Paper Mario. Try feeling around a bit. Oh, don't mind if I do. I'm gonna feel everything. Bad touch! Bad touch! Stranger danger! Maybe you can help me escape from this strange dimension. Mr. Grabby Hands. Feels like the arms are off center and out of control. Maybe try pressing R to reset them. Whoa, what the whoa! A few moments later. <laughs> Wah! Released him. Wow, I'm free! From that weird in-between dimension. Oh, was I just stuck in that wall? He must be Mario! Oh, that I am! My name's Olivia. You'd probably like to know a lot more about me and why I was trapped like that, huh? No, not really! But I don't think we have time for that now. Maybe we should just get out of here. There's just one thing. I'm not exactly fleet of foot. Mind if I hitch a ride? Oh, uh, I don't know about this. Oh! That's mildly inappropriate. You know, I feel like I just had a pretty good idea. I don't know if they'll always be good ideas, but I'm always happy to share them with you. Why don't you try pressing X if you're stuck, and I'll see if I can think of something useful. That's like the minus button in Bug Fables. Who knows, maybe we'll get to know each other and make a great team. Is that how these things go? And you're in my overalls again! Get out of there! Okay, I'm getting my bearings. I think we might be in the castle dungeon. Dungeons smell like this place smells, right? Hey, knock it off! Bowser's getting hurt! Okay, what's going on to Bowser? Oh. I can see what you're about to do to my minion, and I order you to cut it out. Rah! Oh, minus button is like when you need hints. Oh, jeez! They're sacrificing him to their origami gods! Oh. Bowser's forced to watch! Wait, those were the guys that I was just hanging out with! That's the Goomba! Poor Goomba! What did you see? Nothing terrifying, I hope. This got really dark. That was the last of them. Oh no. Except for the mustachioed one. Okay, maybe I have time to explain one little thing. Those stiff looking guys are called folded sh soldiers. I don't want to alarm you, but they're unbelievably dangerous. I think we should try to avoid them. What if I don't avoid them? What if I want to run into danger? Let's see if we can help Bowser out. Hey, Bowser. Mario! You're here too? Well, what are you waiting for? Get me down from this thing! Even if you know that this is no way to treat royalty. Even you know, yeah. Royalty? Ooh, nice to meet you. Is everyone in your kingdom also a face? Burn. I've got a body too. Those folded jerks just bent it in ways that I won't describe in detail right now. Ugh, that's disgusting. That's like breaking his bones. It's seen worse, believe me, his body. 
Well, I mean, yeah, you've been turned into bones and then killed and then brought back to life again. Never mind that. I am the great King Bowser and I demand to be set free and unfolded. Now, Mario, ignore your floating friend and get me down from here. Bowser commands you. I would do the same for you. You need me as much as I need you. Admit it! Plus, I can tell you a secret after you free me. No one can resist a good secret. Bwahahaha. You're such a meathead, Bowser. I don't need to save you. Hey, don't just leave me hanging. Get me down from here. Fine. <laughs> I could just hit him. Ow, 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 ow. Poor Bowser. Oh, kind of thought I'd just unfold or something. Bah, no matter. Now as for that secret I promised to tell you, there's a hidden exit in this room. I heard those jerks talking about it. Lousy, no good, body folding jerks. Now hurry up and find it, and I'll let you bring me along when you escape. Oh wait, you can actually break them! Okay, what do we got here? Secret. See? Wahahaha! Where would you be without me? You're really getting the hang of those a thousand fold arms, Mario. <sighs> We're in danger. Yeah! I'm in danger! Okay, we got a save block already. Nothing much really to save. Oh, I noticed, like, Mario, like, starts thinking or he goes into contemplation whenever he opens the menu. That's a nice little detail. <laughs> Bowser's so tired, man. Hey, slow down. I'm walking with my face here. Nobody makes Bowser walk with his face. I mean, obviously they did. But they're not going to get away with it. Woo! <laughs> oh, the dialogue is hilarious. Oh, no. Evil people. Why are you still so... Flat. Why haven't you joined me in folded glory? Come, we can reshape you. Patience, princess. This will do just fine. So you're Mario, right? Princess Peach's hero, right? Yes, you'll do quite well. Very crisp, bright colors. I can see it now. So what do you say? Will you volunteer your paper body to the cause? Or will we have to get crumply? Join us, yes or no? Oh, actually that sounds pretty good. Why, why don't I give it a shot? Maybe I, I like being folded like Bowser. Oh really? You expect me to fall for such a simple trick? Take a good long look at Princess Peach. She's better this way, don't you think? Oh yeah, she looks pretty nice. I like women that aren't as, you know, flat, if you know what I mean. No need to answer. You'll soon feel the power of origami for yourself. Folded soldiers, come forth! No! It's the Goomba! The Go Goomba that just wanted a great experience in the Mushroom Kingdom! I never got to see Toad. Prepare to be folded! No! I don't want to fight him! This is so sad! Oh no, I'm guessing this is your first time facing folded soldiers, Mario. Once these flat paper folks have been turned into folded soldiers, we can't turn them back. Oh no, there's no way. It seems cool to fight them, but if we don't, they'll try to fold you into origami too. I'd help you attack. Wow, this music is really nice. Line them up. Okay, I think I could do that. Cool. When you group your enemies into a successful lineup like this, your attack power increases by 1.5. Attacks will do more damage, so keep lining up those enemies. Boots and hammer, boots and hammer, boots and hammer, boots and hammer. Boots, cuts, boots, cuts. B, 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 B. 
Now we can flatten these Goombas with a jump attack, select your pair of boots, use L, then press A to begin your attack. What if I choose Hammer instead? Oh wait, that'll just hit two Goombas, but that'll hit four. Okay. Was I supposed to time that? Because I did, but it felt like it was really easy to do. Last wave, there's more? Okay, I guess. More folded soldiers. That's why it's called a wave battle, because they attack in waves. Get it? Yeah, it's kind of hard for me to wrap my head around, too. You guys are lined up a little differently, so show me your hammer. Attack next. Okay, yeah, if they're lined up like a square like that, it's better to use hammer. Okay, yeah, I could do it. Okay, I guess I'm going the other way. But that did 11 damage, so is it slightly weaker than the jump, or is that... I don't know. Okay, yeah. I get sh You get showered with coins after battles. That's kind of like the incentive to battle in this game, from what I understand. So you defeated the first Goomba. Bravo. I assure you it's far from the deadliest creature in this realm. I suppose there's no point in maintaining this raid any longer. What? What? Looks like Olivia! Brother! No, it can't be. I didn't want to believe it could be you. Please, you have to stop now. Why couldn't Mario have simply left you in that wall where I put you? Sister, if you stand in the way of my ambition, I'm afraid you will not share in my glory as family. Oh, and by the way, I am no longer your brother, Ollie. I am King Ollie. Alright, Ollie. By the time I am done, all of those miserable toads will be folded. The flimsy paper minions of Bowser shall be reborn as loyal folded soldiers, serving me. And I shall fold, crease, and bend the entire paper world to my whim. The birth of a new origami kingdom. Oh no, ribbon. <laughs> Mario, my Koopa Clown car. My shy guy's bringing it to me. Let's go. Okie dokie. Glad I could come to the rescue, Mario. Wow. Can't say I haven't seen that one before. Maybe in the first game, something like this happened? I don't know. Just a thought. No, Luigi! <laughs> Luigi's hat! They had to leave! Oh, the shy guy saved King Bowser, but he couldn't save the rest of them. That's funny. Oh, Mario's stuck in a tree. Let's get out. Ooh, I'm stuck in a pickle. Uh, ooh, there we go. Confetti! I need Olivia, and I haven't found Olivia. Okay. Watch out! Unless you can float like me, I'd be careful over there, Mario. Do you see that huge hole in the ground? I don't think you'd like falling into it. Maybe there's a way to fix it, but how? Hmm. Oh, I've got it. Catch this. I got an empty confetti bag, also known as a sack. Did you see the colorful scraps of paper that showered out of the tree when you fell? That's confetti. Everything here is made of paper, of course, so every little bit of confetti is like a tiny piece of our world. That's what the old fans don't like. Let's get some confetti, shall we? Wait. Look at him go. Uh... 
<laughs> yeah, ZR, ha, ZR, boost, ZR, pow, ZR. It's all nothing. Oh, I fell. Oh, I got hurt. No, I didn't mean to fall in again. Uh, yeah, ZR, ZR. There we go. Oh no, I hope you won't always remember me for this moment alone, Mario. Maybe you can help me get my head unstuck somehow. I have an idea. There we go. Woo, that's much better. Thank you. Alright, now where are we? Guess we'll do the thousand fold arms. One of these here. Brothers already folded this whole world to his whims. That's bad news. <clears throat> oh no. Wow, how did he do so much damage? Okay. Oh, I just smack it. Cool. Got a mushroom. Useful item that can restore Mario's health anytime. How much health, though? I'm curious. It gives you 50? It heals you completely! Wowie, I could soak this view up all day long. I mean, just look at that the top of that mountain. It's so... Wait, what's that? That's the outer crust of Peach's castle, isn't it? I saw my brother's streamers wrapping around it. It's lifting it into the air. And then it was gone. Wait, it's there! See? Way up on top of that distant mountain. It's still wrapped up tightly with all the, of those streamers. I'm going to stop you, brother. As your sister, it's my duty. Oh, and we should look for your brother while we're at it. I hope he's okay, too. I hope he's okay. Better not be folded into Mr. L from Super Paper Mario. That'd be crazy. Imagine if they did that. That would be an absolutely insane callback. I'm gonna end it. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. That was a fun beginning to the game. Remember, guys. Life gives you coins. Make one-ups. Bye-bye.